you may not believe this, but this woman was a mail order bride. This jo job offer sounded like work in a marriage agency. That's like really interesting how they call these vacancies. Like, you're not scamming men, you're, you're a model, you're, you're a translator. It was really, really disgusting to look at the photos. Like, does he look by the photo what he has money, which is like so weird. Like, how can you tell it by photo? Men on this side, they're mostly in their 40s, 60s. And the main task of translator is to press on these things, press on the problems of this person. There was also this advice to write down like the birthdays of their children and grandchildren to make it look like you actually care. And this man, he starts to attach to you, he starts to fall in love with you. Um, it's time for me to confess, you've been bamboozled. <laughs> Maybe there is some girls who is actually registering there, but I have never seen such women who just really register to find love. No, they do register to find uh, money. You will get like 100% romantic experience. And also like seems like we can deliver this girl to you. <clears throat> Today it's completely free for you to have a video date face to face with beautiful Eastern European women of all ages and walks of life. Oh my god, <laughs> that's it, I'm all yours. So I, I brought flowers. Wow, it's so beautiful. With makeup or no makeup, hair up, hair down, you always look great. Thank you. You get to ask all your deepest burning questions. Okay, so we will see you live over at ukrainedating.tv. You may not believe this, but this woman was a mail order bride. This jo job offer sounded like work in a marriage agency. Work schedule, six days working, one day off uh, from six hours at any time of the day, preferably at night, because there is more activity. The average salary for beginners, they say it's $200, $300 in the first month, and let me tell you, that is enough to survive in Russia. For more experienced ones from $700 and above, and that's and another conversation. It sounds promising. At first glance, it just sounds like some manager work on the side, but trust me, it is not. The vacancy, vacancy, I don't, I don't know how to say that, I'm sorry. Vacancy, what me and like two our girls, Russian girls, agreed to. It contains two things what you can do, two vacancies. You can do one thing or both, and first one calls model. You can become model if you're just any girl from Russia, Belarus, Philippines, or any other country where it's like equality, human rights, and financial situation is a little lower than in the West. The models, this is these girls who you see on the main page, all these profiles, these insanely beautiful girls, who looks amazing, well-groomed, they look happy, but they couldn't find their love in their country. Very not suspicious. And the manager offered me to become that model. This means what I register on this site, I give them my passport photo, there it must say that I'm 18. Classic registration, name, date of birth, height, weight, body type, passport number. And after registration, what is required for me is to go live for like 30-40 minutes once in a couple weeks and to provide a content to the profile. Like the content what is gonna be shown on the site and what men who are interested in the communication with me will receive. Like photos, videos, that's it. As you can see, talking with potential husbands is not is not work what I'm gonna do. And what do I get if I give out my passport, my photos and videos to this site? I get 10% of all sales which is happening on my profile. And absolutely everything is being sold there. On this site we have everything for building romantic relationship, a messenger where you can chat if you are choosing one, two-way video streaming, and of course all this costs money. There are different subscription levels on this side and as you can see like the free version of subscription gives you gives you about nothing you cannot write a letter to a girl without paying you cannot 
watch photos or videos with this girl attached to her email. But if you have money to spend on this site, you will get like 100% romantic experience. Like, I'll tell you more about this experience a little later, but you can even order on this site some like flowers, gifts, what's gonna be delivered to the girl, and also like seems like you can deliver this girl to you. <clears throat> like, imagine if you're just a girl who gave her photos and passport to the site to receive 10% revenue from that, and they're taking you and uh, you're flying to Texas. That sounds like a real adventure I would go into. No, <laughs> I'm stupid. They claim they help men to go to their chosen one, to their country, like seems like in Russia. But again, is this girl gonna wait for you? And the most funny thing is... Uh, well, no, it's not really funny. I, 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 the, I'd rather say it's sad. If a model needs to provide her real photos, her real videos to site, translator does not need to care about that. It can be girl or a 40 years old man, and this is even better if this is like 40 years old man, because he knows how to talk with other men. Like girl who I know her husband been working there, and I'm gonna tell you he's working much better than any girl have ever been worked there. Because basically all you need to do is know how to use translator and how to manipulate men. Sounds great, doesn't it? I refuse to become a model immediately because I don't want my passport, data and just my photos be on the random site, dating site. But the work of translator seemed interesting for me. So I started undergo training, which was conducted by a man. It was mostly just watching few videos which he sent me and basically they was telling me what my job is to talk with men and to make them fall in love with me and to make them spend money as much as possible on this site. To use paid website features and asking them questions, like encouraging them to give me more personal details so I can um, I can make it look like I do actually care about them. Also, I need to ask them more questions to encourage them to write to me back because it costs money. The man in the background noise explained me all of this very specifically. A lot of information in my brain which I don't want to have. And in addition to these videos, I also receive like the whole document with a lot of pages, with examples of the letters what you gonna say to a man, how to make it correctly. That's the job. That's like really interesting how they call these vacancies. Like, you're not scamming men, you're you're a model, you're, you're a translator. It was really, really disgusting. Then they teach me how to determine is this man worth spending time on him? Like, generally, does he has money? It was mandatory to determine, like, does he has VIP subscription? If man does not have VIP subscription, he been just ignored. To look at the photos, like, does he look by the photo what he has money? Money, which is like so weird. Like, how can you tell it by photo? You may look at me now and think that I have money, but it's just not true. And uh, I was so sad. So sad. Then I read these letters from men, and this usually like really long letters because then every message costs money. You're not gonna write a lot of them. You're gonna make one, but with a lot of sentences. And you just read this letter, their person talks about their problems, about their family, about their children, grandchildren and mostly they had grandchildren because men on this side they're mostly in their 40s, 60s and he tell all of this to some like beautiful girl from Belarus depends on which profile translator attached to each translator can get one profile or two profile or even three profiles if you're like professional and the main task of translator is to press on these things press on the problems of this person there was also this advice to write down like the birthdays of their children and grandchildren to make it look like you actually care. 
and this man he starts to attach to you he starts to fall in love with you um it's time for me to confess you've been bamboozled no like i agreed to this job only to see like from the inside how it all works i infiltrated as an agent to there so um no american man was uh, scammed by me and i just disappeared without even registering to this maybe site. there is some girls who is actually registered there but I have never seen such women who just really register to find love no they do register to find uh, money Today, it's completely free for you to have a video date face-to-face -face with beautiful Eastern European women of all ages and walks of life. Oh my god! <laughs> That's it, I'm all yours! So I, I brought flowers! Wow, it's so beautiful! With makeup or no makeup, hair up, hair down, you always look great! Thank you! You get to ask all your deepest burning questions okay so we will see you live over at ukrainedating.tv